startups run on data, but let's be real. Wrangling with it can feel like a full-time job. What about if you could take a simple idea for a dashboard and turn it into a sleek, functional application within a matter of minutes without writing a single line of code? Hey, founders, creators, and no-code enthusiasts, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into Buzzy, the AI-powered no-code platform that allows you to transform your ideas to full working applications faster than you can say monthly recurring revenue. If you're into no code tools, startup hacks, and AI magic, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. Well, this is where your next big idea takes shape. Okay, so let's start with a prompt. Let's create a dashboard application for startups that tracks key metrics like monthly recurring revenue, customer acquisition cost, burn rate, and more. Let's watch this. So we're going to start over here. Let's click, let's start. I've got a prompt prepared. And we can see that we're going to give it instructions about what we want. So we're going to create a dashboard. We're going to say five key business metrics, so things like MRR, customer churn rate, cost of acquisition, customer engagement, and cash flow right away. We're also going to ask to put together a dashboard that's going to show us metrics or a chart for each one of these metrics. And some more instruction that we're going to do that. Now we're going to do the chart with the code widget, and I'll do that in a subsequent set. But let's go through the process. So the first step over here is we create the brief. A brief is like a mini product requirements document or PRD. It describes everything about the application at a super high level. So here's our brief. We've got a name, start metrics dashboard. We've got a description. We've got the core functions, submit metrics, view dashboard, manage dashboard, et cetera, and recommendations. So we get insights and so on. And then there's different user roles. And then importantly, there's the data requirements. If it's not right, you can go back and you can change it. The next step is we're going to create the database or the underlying data model that's going to drive the application. So here's the first version of that data model. So we can see that we've got the metrics over here. So things like MRR and it knows that it's a currency, you know, a number, which is customer churn rate. Um, we've also got the understanding of the dashboard and it's got that code widget. So every single one of those metrics is going to show up as a code widget, which can then show a chart for it. And then we've got the recommendations of things like insights and actions and some information about the user. So that's pretty good. Let's go to the next step over here, which we're going to choose the design. We'll choose this mint look and feel. I like that. And now it's going to generate all the application screens, feature functions, and hook it up to the backend database. Pretty amazing. What's happening behind the scenes is Buzzy is building an app definition. A Buzzy app definition describes everything about the underlying data structure, its security, its look and feel, how it features, how it functions. From that, it's then going to generate a set of screens and tie them to the backend data model or database and get everything working. The AI agents are hard at work. They'll actually go through multiple iterations and understand whether it's found an issue in the application that's been generated and fix that. So you'll see it running your auto fix in that. This does take several minutes, but it's well worth it. It's a lot faster than coding and manually making those updates yourself. Cool. So it's been a few minutes. Let's actually have a look at the first version of the application. So we're going to open this up in the AI editor. Boom. It's created a full application for us that's ready to have a look at. So we can click around this. So we're in preview mode here. So we can have a look at that. And we can see over here, we've got space placeholders for the metrics. Now the details don't exist and we're going to issue another command to be able to modify it. So we can see over here, we've got the different metrics. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go into this chat. I'm going to say, write the code for the code widget field. Put a dashboard table that's going to show metrics from the metric data table and then show it as a spline chart and create a chart with smooth lines and fill for modern bread. So let's just fix that over there. Typo. And we're going to send it this instruction and we're going to send modify the code widget. Let's see how we go. Cool. So we're going to say, hey, modify the code widget. And now it's going to make those changes for us. So it's that easy to be able to use AI and this chat within the Buzzy Design Editor to modify your application without writing any code. Cool. So let's have a look at this, the changes that have been made by the AI. Let's have a look at that. We can see the charts are loading. And here we go. Here are those charts. So we've got position costs, our financial health, engagement metric, customer engagement, churn rate, and then MRR. How cool is this? Literally no code. I could create a full working application in a matter of minutes modify with AI chat. Absolutely amazing. So Buzzy isn't just a tool, it's your startup secret weapon. So if you need a prototype for investors, if you don't want to build internal tools to launch an MVP, easy with this AI smarts, Buzzy keeps you in the driver's seat 
while handling the heavy lifting allows you to create something really quickly. Ready to turn your ideas into apps without hiring a developer or pulling all-nighters? Head to www.buzzy.buzz and give it a try. And before you go, smash that like button if this demo blew your mind. Subscribe for more game-changing tools and comment below what's the app you'd love to build with Buzzy. We'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching.